Hello and welcome back to some more Europa Universalis 4 as the Netherlands. Well, the struggle continues to find a good way to attack Munster. It's been tough. Uh, but, what I do want to do is attack Burgundy. Um, ASAP. He's all on his own. Actually, let's build up Spy Network. Are we doing that? We're doing that. Okay. Maybe let's give it a second to build up. I'd like to possibly get another claim. See, Munster's just hiding behind Austria. Now, here's something I didn't really think about and should have. <clears throat> he's allied... Oh, no, I'm sorry. He's rivals. He's allied to... I'm looking at the wrong one. Uh, he's allied to Frankfurt, the Platinate. We just fought in Norway. Where is Frankfurt these days? There you, there you are, your little, little Frankfurt down there. Um, and the Platinate is even further away. Okay, so there's not really any way to attack his ally and have him get called in. That wouldn't be the best way to do it, but it would be a way to do it. Okay, but not so much at the moment. Um, we can keep building some trade depots, which I would like to do. Almost everything is in the English Channel node, which is nice. Oh, I lost ferocity. Let's go ahead and build one there. Um, we're not quite at our force limit. We could be at our force limit, however. Making some good cash, that's for sure. 60% of our incomes from trade. Should we go up to our force limit? <coughs> <coughs> oh my gosh. Excuse me. I don't know how many of you stuck with me since uh, I had that pretty bad cold a while ago, but it's still not quite gone. Super fun. Uh, why do we have this over, or why do we have this? Okay, I was gonna say, I thought we were done with this core. Almost there. Almost. And there it is. Alright, so unrest is down to five. The unlawful territory, the separatism. So that's that. Um... Okay, let's go check on the colonies. We've got three going on. Let's put you in the middle. Uh, let's see, you're getting 130 a year, which is incredible. 23% chance, 25% chance of more. So you guys are growing pretty well. Nanacoke is the one without the colonist. No biggie there. Our colonial nation is doing very well. Uh, they like us even, which is fantastic. And they're building more ships. Way to go, boys. Keep it up. <clears throat> uh, Oldenburg, I'd like to have you be a vassal soon. Oh my gosh. I own a core province. I own... Oh, is this your core province? Well, here's the thing. I kind of want it. <clears throat> so, we may not be friends with you all that long, to be honest. <clears throat> I can't, of course, attack you right away. But, I don't know how long we're going to be super close, Oldenburg. I guess for now you're... You're okay. You won't even join me in this war. There's honestly no... There's no, honestly no reason for you to be here. Where was that uprising? Now it's over here. Uh, air strength. Do we need our air to be strong? I don't know. 
I guess we're gonna go that way. My gosh. The uprisings. They're everywhere. <clears throat> Colonial Louisiana is to Portugal, huh? Okay. Let's go back home. So, um, <clears throat> we're almost ready to get this claim. And then I think... I don't know if we're going to be able to. We might get too much aggressive expansion. I'd like to just eat Burgundy if possible. We may not be able to. We're going to try. But now you're allied to Venice. Well, that's a slight complication, isn't it? Venice, what do you look like these days? You get 35,000 troops with 45,000 manpower. That's nothing to sneeze at. <clears throat> I didn't really want to bother to bring anyone in. I could bring in Sardinia Piedmont and you could... You'd be crushed. <clears throat> He'd love to fight Venice. However, I don't want to use those favors up for that. Speaking of, why do you not like me that much? Our religions differ. Wow, this colony grew quick. Well, let's build up some manpower. I'm sorry, let's build up some military. <clears throat> We've got 24 and 14. Let's go like that. I'm not going to worry about any more cavalry. I think we should build some more light ships. We've got tons of capacity for ships. So let's just go with them. Let's get this other claim on Picardy. Oh, let's figure out what to do with our military tech. We're quite high on that. Let's see, what do our neighbors have? You've got 19, you've got 21. Okay. Maybe we'll develop a little with it. Meppen, Antwerpen, Zealand. Okay, get these guys over here, get in position, hey, we got a colony. We'll make this a state. Um, was that one that was using our colonist? It was. All right, so which way do we go? What's our mission right now? <coughs> oh, we're just to make Oldenburg vote for us? It's not going to happen. That was a dumb mission. So which one of these shall we go for next? Um, we should probably go for a seven. Should we go inland? Hmm. I kind of like the ones on the coast. But. Oh, we can't go that way anyways. Uh, should we go for Lenape since it's a six? Sure, why not? We'll border these guys. Oh, we'll border Sweden. Hmm, do we want to border Sweden? Yeah, let's go. This is an estuary. That's a good one to go for. Very good. <clears throat> the troops are in position. Let's bring you guys down.
Alright, you can come back, I suppose. You didn't really do a whole lot, but that's enough. Are all the ships done? <clears throat> Alright, so we've got four. Um, oh, jeez, come on. Okay, we got it. There's been a lot of uprisings. I don't want to get rid of them completely because they do help you when you get the colony established. You get a few more developments sometimes. Um, let's split this and say, let's see. Yeah, two should definitely go to Lubeck. <clears throat> Seems like you should go to Lubeck as well. I wonder if it's worth sending any over to the Caribbean. Maybe not yet. Seems like they should all go to Lubeck. Alright. Does that mean we've got too many in the channel? Hmm. We're pushing from here. And we're pushing from here, which is the right moves. <coughs> Where's our other champagne? Are we pushing from all the way down here? Where's champagne? Yeah, that's where that's what I thought. Oh, I'm sorry, we're pushing from Rhineland as well. Okay. I wonder if it's worth just pushing this guy from the North Sea instead, because this is like two nodes back. It's kind of we're losing a lot there. Then again, everything should be coming here, right? Local six. Ten. So we're losing two is being collected here that should not be. We should be getting all of it. I'm going to leave it as is. <clears throat> well, we maxed out our admin again. Uh, I don't really want to go up to three stability. That's silly. <clears throat> I guess we'll do some development as well. Oops, we are already there. Let's see. Zealand? Holland? I'm not going to help out the new world just yet. There we go. <clears throat> okay, we got to figure out what we're doing against Burgundy. Yes, we have colonies next to Sweden. Do we want to attack him and Venice? I have no desire to bring my army down in Venice. None to zero desire. Um, however, I have no other people to attack. Clearly I can't attack France with his friend, the Commonwealth. That's insane. We're not going to be the defender of the faith. Well, I guess I should have declared this before he was allies. I took my time to get that other claim. That was probably dumb. Me one on one against Venice, though. I think I can take them. They're still at 35, max 36. <clears throat> We're already above that. We might as well get three more and be at our force limit. Uh, what? What do these guys have right now? So, we still got th three shock and half fire. Wondering how worth it it is to have cavalry at this point. We're probably still... I don't know. I'm assuming it's still worth having cavalry. I guess. We're going to get to a point where I know that it's silly too. I guess maybe we're not there just quite yet. Uh, do we want to declare this war? I might as well call in Oldenburg because I don't expect to be friends with him too long. No one else wants to join. 
Lubeck's already fighting. Now you're already fighting, so you wouldn't want to join anyways. But that's fine, because I did not want to... Oh, Venice is in that war. Oh, now this is interesting. Defender against the Alstacian conquest of Aiken. <coughs> well, that is interesting. And... Aiken is against Trier, so Alsace is attacking Trier. You jumped in to help, so Denia Piedmont's on the other side. Trier advanced Frankfurt, Hanoi Platinet against. Oh, interesting. Okay, well, maybe we should just give this a minute and see how exhausted Venice gets, or at least give him a chance to get stuck into that war. Uh, established colonial nation is that. We could turn this into a city. Nanacoke, which is super close. Let's do that one. That will be done soon. All right. Well, maybe Venice will tire themselves out. They're being attacked. So that's good. Hey, there's another colony. Part of a different state. Of course it is. <clears throat> and now the clergy wants some land. Do you now? Oh, that's nice. Cabinet cooperation. Alright, so you want some land then, huh, clergy? What do you need? You expect 10. You're at 9.8%. What if I just develop the province you already have? Which one do you already have up here? The clergy has what? Do you not have any up here? There you are. Let's just develop you. <clears throat> um, this is the lowest. So we'll go up a few on there. Did that not help you out? Not enough? What else do you own? The clergy is what? What color are you? It says 10% now. Oh, there we go. It just took a minute to catch up. Okay, good. What's the uh, 67? I can get everyone on this province. Cool. Although Ostfries land still needs you. Maybe I should send everyone over there for now. While we wait on this war. It's not going to take that long. Come back. Let's just check on Venice. Yeah, they're not losing any interest. Although Oldenburg is now fighting with Verdine. Who started that war? Verdinian conquest of where? St oh, the Brunswickian conquest of state. Okay. Austria again, huh? Uh, what else should we build? Um, we should probably... <clears throat> I'd like to get to here and build shipyards. Should we upgrade any of these for more sailors? Or should we just keep going marketplaces? Oh yeah, this is a good one here. Because of that estuary. Very good. We got our mission. Let's go ahead and core you. Um, we'll take this because we will be very close to getting that done. We've got two more colonists to use. Or sorry, I guess we have one more colonist to use. <coughs> uh, we'll go into the uh, Susquehanna now. And now we need to pick another rival, huh? France, Sweden, or Venice? Well... 
Venice would be dumb. France would be scary. Uh, that's a tough call. Sweden would be okay, but they're super powerful. Right? Are you still really powerful, Sweden? Yeah. Not a lot more powerful than me, but more powerful. And I don't know how I feel about that. Well, nothing's happening down here. Jeez. Huh. I'm surprised I can still be rivals with Munster. We need to do something about that. I guess we're going to go with Venice. I was still hoping we could be friends with Austria while he's the Emperor, but... Oh, now he's ra now he's allied to Munster. We actually could be friends with him if we got rid of those relationships, but it is what it is. Wonder if it's I wonder if we should rival him though. I don't know. I don't like that idea. I just don't. But when are we ever gonna really realistically fight Venice? I mean, I guess we're going to against Burgundy. I don't know. Let's just... We'll go with Venice for now. Let's do it. Military tech. No. We got to do a lot of... We got a lot of extra points here. A lot of extra points. <clears throat> Which is crazy. We also should definitely go up. Let's get... Uh, why can't I get you? There we go. Let's get you. I don't care about that, so we'll keep the we'll keep the two. And prestige. Is there a better one than prestige? Missionary strength? No. Okay, we'll get we'll stay there. Oh, okay, here we go. You're losing some interest not we could attack you as well which I don't care about but trade good we got some pretty good trade goods so far this siege is going like molasses oh good we got a wall breach perfect perfect how's our unrest a little bit would you go take care of those please Check on uh, the Dutch Isles. How we doing? Pretty good. And we're at our max manpower again. I mean our max <clears throat> diplo points. So, what am I looking for? The development. Let's develop some more. And while I'm here... Get one more over here. Antwerpen. Yeah, that's fine. How's this war going? Nothing happening? <clears throat> uh, what else should we build? Should we replace our dry docks? Let's do that. We'll upgrade you. Should we upgrade our barracks as well? I mean, we've got the money. Let's just go through and do improvements. <clears throat> Might as well. Check out Venice's enthusiasm. It is falling quickly. All right, you got the siege done. Was that a... It is a big province. Wow. Napoli. <clears throat> I 
Who's got the bigger... Let's. I'm interested in the uh, highest development province. Let's see. Rome's 38. What's Paris? 47. That's pretty high. London? 39. What's our highest? Well, clearly 23 is not very high. 30... Is our highest 30 in Breda? Yeah. Okay. What about <clears throat> 44? It's pretty good. So what was it? Paris 47? Yeah, that's a big one. Unless uh, I didn't go to Vienna 40. Who else is normally pretty large capitals? Milan's usually pretty big, right? 34. I know there's a map mode for this that would not waste that much time, but... Who could be bothered for using the tools the game gives you? I don't have time for that. Uh, Venice is still losing. Whoops. Whoop, and he's out. Alright. The time has come. We shall declare. I'm not going to bring anyone in at the moment. I don't think we need to. Let's just head in against, we'll take Hanat as well. Uh, we'll take Artois because that'll be the easier one to take and let's get this rolling <clears throat> I'm not even gonna bother with our heavies um, let's take our ships from Lubeck and bring them in to blockade him <coughs> You're, of course, going to run. France declared war on Austria. Whoa. That's serious. French reconquest of Frig Frigis Frushaft. What? Wow, this place gets renamed a ton. That used to be that Franche Camache province. Yikes. Well, this is going to be fun. I'm going to enjoy... Get the popcorn out and watch this one. Who's sowing discontent? Is that Munster? Sneaky bastard. I guess I don't need all of you here. Let's just detach what we need and let's go back to Lubeck. Wow, was that quick? I think that seed or that um, spy network really helps. Munster has accepted to take regiments from Frankfurt. Oh, that's fantastic. All right, you five can go back to protecting in Lubeck. Oh. Hey, fur. That's not a very good one. I think a lot of North America is fur, though, right? What's the price of fur? Three fifty. That's eh, not terrible. Oh, it's better than tobacco. Okay. Didn't realize that. Hey, hundred population. That's nice. So this is going very quickly. Venice is losing this battle. Sardinia Piedmont is everywhere. They've got ships building, armies everywhere. Although they're not willing to fight this guy just yet. Venice still has a pretty strong navy. I'm assuming once this fort falls, this will be over. 
Sure enough, it is. <clears throat> All right, should we just um, let's peace out Hanat? Should we make him a vassal? We could. That'd be cool. Been looking for a vassal. Um, sort of stupid to do anything else. I don't want to keep him. Yeah, let's make him a vassal. We'll get 12 aggressive expansion. <clears throat> we could force religion as well. Which would make him upset. But we could do it. We could do these things without lose without getting any aggressive expansion. And we could make him not be friends with France anymore. Well, he has access. Should we should we take a vassal or not? Um I don't know. I don't know what to do. I wasn't really anticipating you being in here, Hanat. I don't know what to do with you. Let's do it. What the heck? We will force his religion as well though. Yeah, let's go for it. There we go. And finally, oh, we lost an advisor. Let's do this with you. Now, what happens if we take you? We might get, yeah, okay, we can't. That's a shame. We could get, hmm. I guess we'll just take Artois. That stinks. I knew we'd be close on the aggressive expansion. We could do that. Uh, we could not make him a vassal. We could make him transfer trade power and war reps. He doesn't have any other good relationships. Well, we could force religion on him as well. Well, that's good. And then we will get aggressive expansion. But <clears throat> it won't be... Can I humiliate him? Oh, he's not my rival. Right? He's not my rival, so that wouldn't matter. Okay. Would this be better? I can't... I can't take his province and have him con concede defeat. Okay. We'll do this. Um, let's give up claims instead. Oh, I can't do both. All right, we'll do transfer trade power and war reps then. Deal. Stay low on aggressive expansion, as low as possible. Nice. Uh, let's move you guys over to here. I thought I forced my religion on him. Wait, where's Artisy? Oh, this is... So wait, I guess, all right, so he, I, I understand now. He switches his state religion, but the provinces still need converted. Right, that makes sense. Should I court first or should I, well, I already sent my guy, that's fine. And you are super pissed, which I understand, but we'll royal marry you. Uh, the Commonwealth. No, I don't want you traipsing around over here. We're way ahead on our tech, which is crazy. Um, okay, well, we're going to have some maintenance to do regarding our new acquisitions. Um, but I think we'll call it an episode here. We will stop spying on Burgundy. And like I said, we'll do some maintenance. We will still and very much look forward to Austria losing this war against France so that we can attack Munster. That's still on the radar.
I did not forget about you, Munster. I didn't let you off the hook yet. So we will look to that once, hopefully, France beats up on Austria. Although that has not been historically how it has gone in this playthrough. France has been very inept. We might even rent him troops and make sure... In fact, that's what we will do. We'll try to rent him a large portion of our army and try to direct his efforts if possible. We'll look at that in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. Please do subscribe and drop a like if you've been enjoying it. I really appreciate it. I will catch you in the next one.